Why do I live in such a horrible house? Why? Hmm, it's not a house, it's a barn. I have no money at all. And my job said they don't need me anymore. Oh, why is fate so cruel to me? I'm very hungry. Oh no, but there's nothing in my fridge but green potatoes. Oh, hmm, I'm gonna go take out the trash. Maybe I'll find some food in the trash. Oh, what am I thinking? This poverty is driving me crazy. I'm not going to look for food in the garbage. I'm never gonna do that. I'm gonna get a job and food. I can do it 100%. <gasps> Who are these beautiful girls? Oh, it's very noticeable. That's what I'm telling her. That purse is too cheap. Oh, so beautiful. I want to meet them. I'll say what the girls like. Goddesses, hey, you girls are beautiful. Can I meet you? That's what I'm telling Shh, you. Wait, some poor guy wants to meet us. Huh. Don't talk to us, Popper. He thinks a ragamuffin is worthy of our beauty. Wow. Funny. But I just wanted to meet you both. I want love too, even though I'm a pauper. Oh, I have to admit, I'm not going to get anywhere in this life. I should just accept the hopelessness of my situation and live out my last days in my barn. Hey, hey, everybody. Today is just the most beautiful day. The sun is so hot, I want to go for a swim. Look over there. I'm so glad I have such an awesome pool for days like today. Yeah, oh my god. What could be better than a swim in the pool on a hot day like this? I don't think there's anything better than a swim in the pool today. What am I talking about? I live in such a great house. I should appreciate my life and enjoy every moment of it. Oh, what's that? Buy a yacht only today. Hmm for one million dollars. Wow, it's so cheap. I'm gonna buy this boat, it's a dime a dozen. I'm gonna take my friend Mikey on a road trip. I think he's gonna love hearing this from me. I'm wondering if he still lives in that poor neighborhood. I hope not, because I wish him well. It's time to take my favorite $150,000 car and go to Mikey's. Oh, I still can't get enough of this car. It looks very stylish, I love it. Anyway, I gotta get going. I still have to stop by to buy a boat and then go look for Mikey. Hmm, I still need to stop for groceries and also hire a crew for the yacht. And I also need to make an itinerary for our boat trip. Where should we go? How about the island? Oh my god, I've got so much to do. By the way, the bus we need should have gotten here a long time ago. Oh, what lovely ladies. Why don't I meet them? Oh, look over there. Wow, this car is incredibly expensive. What a cool car. Who's driving? Whoa, who's that guy? Whoa. Hmm, lovely ladies. Would you both like to ride in my cool car with me? Oh my god, you're still asking? I say yes. Of course we want to ride with you. This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. Let's go for a ride. What's your name? We're sisters. It's going to be mega cool. Sorry to talk about it, but not this time. I'm in a hurry right now. What? Bye-bye. How so? Get back here. What a jerk, but so handsome. We remembered you. Huh, girls are so easy to fall for pretty things. Uh, does Mikey really still live in that old dilapidated house? Hmm, well, we should check to see who lives here. It'll be amazing if this is Mikey's house. Mikey, it's your friend JJ. Open the door, I'm here to visit. Hmm, oh, hey. Mikey, what's up, buddy? Things are getting worse, JJ. Oh my God, what happened? Life is downhill, no food at all. Uh, come on in the house. Uh, okay. It's not really a house, it's my shed. Yes, your house is in a very dilapidated state. Yes. Why don't you have any money, Mikey? I've been fired from my job, it's a nightmare. I'm living out my last days here. Uh, Mikey, come on a road trip with me. Uh, traveling. Yeah, a yacht trip. Are you sure about that? I'm all set, but I'm missing the most important thing, you. Hmm, stay here to die or go on a sea voyage with my best friend. Oh my God. JJ, let's go. Cool, my car's outside. Uh, JJ, can I drive your car? Hmm. I'll be careful, I promise you. Oh, of course you can drive my car. Holy turtles. It's gonna be a breeze, huh? Yay! It's been so long since I've driven a car. Oh! Thank you, JJ, for letting me drive your car. Oh, you're welcome. Let's hurry up. I'm so excited. Hurry up, hurry up. Wow, JJ, that car looks very expensive. That's the way it is. I can't believe I'll be driving such an expensive car right now. Well, time is of the essence. Let's hit the road. <gasps> what are you so surprised about? Uh, nothing, nothing at all. What do you think of the interior of my car? One steering wheel here is worth more than my whole life. How much does it cost? Well, I bought it at a discount, just under $150,000. Stop! What? Oh, I can already feel the sea breeze. Mikey, look over there. There's our yacht. JJ, it's just an incredibly big boat. There's also a lot of food. Oh my god, will I be allowed to eat there? Yeah. JJ, how much money did you spend on this? A lot of money, Mikey. A lot of money. Wait, why? Well, uh, it's a lot of money to you. It's nothing to me. JJ, you are unbelievable. Uh, I'm jealous of you, but in a white way. That's good to hear. By the way, the yacht has swimming pools. Wow, I can already see one of the pools. Oh. Whoa, it's so beautiful here. I'm glad you like it here. <laughs> Do you want to go for a swim? Oh, yeah. Yeah, sure, yeah. Yay. The water is such a nice temperature. Nice. Wow, this pool is heated. Come on out. There's a lot more to see. Is there anything more interesting here than a swimming pool? Yes, of course. And this isn't the only pool here, so you'll have time to swim. Wow, is this man the captain of a ship? Yeah. Oh, hello. I'm the captain of this fine yacht. Hey. Since you're here, we can go 
sailing. Hmm. An unforgettable voyage to different islands awaits Ooh. you. The journey will be long enough to keep you entertained in the play cool. area. Sounds awesome. There is also your sleeping quarters. Nice. Enjoy the journey. Thank you. I want to see it all soon. Then let's go. Yes, you're right. Let's take a look at the playroom. I'm very interested. Wow, there's a pool table in here. Well, I was expecting a little more, but it's fun too. Hmm. Yeah, I'm a little disappointed too. Well, let's take a look at our sleeping quarters. Okay, let's go. Uh, well, it's pretty cozy in here. Oh, hmm. What do you think, Mikey? Well, it's much more comfortable here than at my house, huh? We've got a long way to go. Yeah, I think we're going to be pretty tired. Let's rest here for a while. Yeah, and later we'll go to the pool. Two hours later. Hello again, everyone. Our boat is already on the high seas. Now Mikey and I decided to lounge in the pool. He's just lying there. Hello again, everyone. We're here relaxing like normal guys with money. Normal guys? You're on my money here on vacation, remember? Of course I remember. It's just a joke. Look how I dive. Wow, Mikey, you're so cool. Of course, I love swimming. Why can't we swim off the side of the boat? What's going on? There's some kind of explosion. Everybody off the ship. We got a breach in the deck. Save yourselves. Where's the hole? In the center of the deck. I won't give you your trip money back. Goodbye, everyone. Save yourselves! Oh god, Mikey, we are drowning. Our yacht is sinking. What do we do? Is our boat sinking? We have to save ourselves. There's a life raft on the boat. Did he say life raft? Yes! Then let's get to the dinghy before our boat breaks in half. This dinghy doesn't look very promising. JJ, that's something at least. Just why did the captain of the ship sail on his own if there are boats like this here? I don't know. Why did the captain jump off the ship first? He acted like a coward. Why would he save someone else's life when he's got his own? Because it's his job. He's the captain of the ship. Okay, we survived survived a sinking ship. What do we do next? I don't know. JJ, look, our boat's going down. Oh my God, Mikey, we got out of there just in time. I think we should just wait for help. We have no food, no water, no compass. We have nothing. We're stuck in the middle of the ocean. Our chances of survival are slim. Maybe we should get to some island and start surviving there. But where do you see an island around here, Mikey? There's nothing but vast ocean beyond the horizon. Three hours later. I'm so thirsty and hungry, I'm dehydrated. Are we on some kind of island? We should look for people. Mikey, Mikey, wake up. We're on the island. I can't do it alone without you. Wake up already. We have to find people. Huh? What? I fell asleep a little bit. Where are we, JJ? We're on an unknown island. We should explore it and look for food. Then what are we waiting for? Let's go explore the island. Hopefully there's electricity and we can call 911. Oh, Mikey, did you hear that? It's the cry of a sheep. There's a village near here. Yeah, JJ, you're right. It's a village on an island. Yes, the village. Mikey, we're saved. They'll feed us and help us. This is so great. Yeah, that's awesome. I hope they know how to make burgers. I'm pretty hungry for today. Yeah, that's a good point. I'm having some kind of deja vu with this island, though. It's like I've lived here before. All these houses look familiar. Let's go, JJ. Maybe you dreamed it in your sleep. Maybe, but so far I don't see any residents here. Where's everybody gone? Maybe they're hiding from us. I don't want to survive on a desert island. Oh, JJ, look, it's the Islanders. Yes, they're women. We should meet them. Girls, look, it's TV Man. He's so handsome. Hey, girls. Oh, my God, look how beautiful he is. Are they sure it's me they're talking about? Of course, you're the only gorgeous one on this island. Give us something to eat and drink. Will you shut up? Don't you see? I'm talking to the handsome man. Yes, don't you dare open your filthy mouth. Mouth here. And with you, handsome, let's talk more. Oh, you're all so beautiful today. We jumped off a sinking ship and came here. Could you give us some food and water? We haven't eaten anything in a long time. Food? Of course. Come with us, honey. We'll give you anything you ask for. Will you stay with us longer? Of course, girls. JJ, I'm so lucky. They all love me so much. Have a seat here. We'll give you something to eat, dear. We have fresh meat and meat pizza for dinner. We really like to eat meat. Help yourself, my boy. So cool. I'm honored here. That's weird. Why didn't they like me? I'll eat with Mikey then. He's not going to eat all this anyway. But these ladies cook very good food. I've never seen anything like it on the mainland. Eat up, honey. You need to put on weight. You're getting skinny. Hey, what's that green guy's name? My name is Mikey. Thank you all so much for this delicious food. Oh, he thanked us. What a polite young man. Listen, ladies, we have nowhere to sleep. Could you put us in a house somewhere? Of course. Come sleep with us, Mikey. Nah, we'll give him his own place. He's a guest. He's such a beautiful guest. How nice of you. I didn't expect such hospitality from you. Thank you very much for everything. Anything for you, Mikey. We really like you. You are the best girls in the world. If you get lonely tonight, you can call us. We'll bring more food. Thank you, of course, but we're both so full. You're a delicious cook. Thank you so much. Good night, Mikey. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye, girls. Thanks for everything. 
Mikey, let's go to bed. Yeah, let's go to sleep. Oh, they're coming back. Stop, you stupid speaker. You're not allowed to sleep in there. But why can't I sleep there? Because we made your bed somewhere else. Follow us. We'll show you where you belong. Okay, okay, let's go take a look. It's right there. This is where you're gonna sleep. Just what you need. A house made out of newspapers? Are you serious? Put me in a normal house. Yeah, that's a little much for my friend. We don't know anything. All the houses are occupied. Oh, really? Are you suggesting I sleep on the floor? Uh, yeah, sure. Good night again, Mikey. Yeah, good night, Mikey. We should get going. We got a lot of things to do tomorrow. Bye-bye, girls. Good night to you all. Thank you again for the whole house. Well, JJ, it's sad that you got a bed on the street. But it's okay, you'll get over it. I don't think they'll listen to me. I gotta go to bed. Good night. Good night, Mikey. He didn't even try to ask them. Friends, have you ever slept on the streets in a tent? Write about it in the comments. And it's time for me to lay down in this pile of papers. It's a shame the way these girls treat me. I tried to be polite, but they liked Mikey for some reason. All right, girls, let's take this tasty little beauty out back to the fire. We've fed him. It's time for us to taste him. I've already built a fire. Take him over there. Be quiet before he wakes up. Ha ha ha, I hope it will be very tasty. I love to eat people. The next day. Oh my God, my back hurts from those papers, but I'll get over it. Good morning, friends. Did you put a like under this video? By the way, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. I can't look at these papers anymore. I gotta go check on Mikey. Maybe he's still asleep. Of course, in a house this comfortable, I'd sleep forever. Mikey, wake up. Let's go for a walk. Stop sleeping, Mikey. Mikey, don't sleep. It's daytime. Get out of the house. Why does it smell like smoke and campfire? Is somebody barbecuing? Oh, there's girls making fire. Oh, hold on. They're burning Mikey. They want to eat him? What? We're on Cannibal Island. What are we supposed to do? Oh my God.